Hi guys. I received a lot of questions about Huawei MatePad Pro's PS mode. Uh, what is it? How does it work? Is there anything special? I thought I'd do a quick video and uh, see what's up. Okay, let's find out. Okay, let's see. So to start the PS mode, we have to drag down the tab here and uh, and we click this button. This button doesn't actually say PS mode, it says free windows. Now I can no longer scroll up and see my open applications as I could before. To see if I closed it down here again, now I can open up like a tab. Yeah, let's go back to PS mode. Ah, yes, I want to show you again. We can do this. Yeah. And you see this is full screen. So now we open this one in full screen, we go PS mode, and now it's windowed mode. So now I can use the mouse and grab the window and drag it around. I can also reposition it and uh, change the size. So here I'm putting it on the side and I can uh, tile it with another window. So I have the browser and I have um, uh, the books, the Huawei book app. And you see I can resize them together. And now these are stored as a uh, grouped. So you can see here if I go Alt Tab, I have I can open uh, the AI life I've put them before, but you see these are grouped as one application or one window group, I would say. And here I put the calendar on top, for example. If I close, it goes back to this uh, half screen windowed. Yeah. You can go full screen, of course. And this is like the menu bar. <clears throat> here I can go back, yeah. It's kind of standard, like, Laptop doesn't really behave like this, but uh, I get the idea. It's very similar. Yeah, so let's minimize. And uh, what would a PC be without shortcuts? So here are keyboard shortcuts uh, that will work. So you see you have this O, this is like a function key or how I open harmony, open. Yeah, I'm not sure what they always want. I guess open harmony. Uh, so now you can use this one, uh, or shift uh, S to take a screenshot. That's a bit finicky. So O shift S to take a screenshot. And I can, uh -huh. okay, there we go. O shift S. And then mark this area on the screenshot. Yeah, this keyboard. Totally before in the previous video. Don't buy this. You can achieve the same result with that Bluetooth mouth and a Bluetooth keyboard. And O Shift R starts a screen recording. And as you can see here, and I can just yeah. uh, cancel it like that. And this is O uh, yeah. O N, which brings up the applications or the notification bars. So I can close my notification. This is O C, uh, brings up the control panel or yeah, the settings panel. And as you can see here, Alt uh, O Shift makes it calls it the application hub, uh, but yeah, it's basically Alt Tab. And of course, file um, management. So OF brings up the file manager. It's of course very useful. It's a lot of drag and dropping with files if you use a PC, so of course you want that. Yeah. So O Shift L, or O L, it's lock, lock screen. And uh, you can see here, I'm not sure if I showed this before, but here I have the face recognition. And uh, there are some other shortcuts as well. Uh, these are the useful ones. These are mainly for shifting focus between windows. 
So overall, I think the PSO mode is, I mean, it's not fully laptop uh, feeling or laptop OS uh, UI. It is a tweak on the UI uh, as it is. Uh, nice shortcuts, uh, nicer to write and so on. But uh, overall, I don't think it's, it's nowhere near as a uh, full-fledged PC OS. Uh, but maybe the rumors are that there would be a Harmony OS PC coming up, coming out here uh, this year. So I'm super excited for that. I have a laptop ready uh, to install that OS on. So that, that should be fun and interesting. Okay, that's all. See you later, guys. Bye-bye.